What is going on guys? Welcome back. Today we are doing something a little different. We have a piece of private property that we're able to duck hunt and uh, it, it turned out to be a pretty good spot last year. Great little woody hole. So we decided, um, talked to the owner and got permission to put a blind up. Uh, and it's just one of those spots where it's it's perfect really. So we got permission and we, we just wanted to have a blind. We figured it'd be nice. Really in Pennsylvania, we don't have too, too many options for having a good little duck hole that warrants putting a blind in, but this one does. So that's what we're gonna do today. Um, kind of talk you through some stuff, I guess, but overall, this is gonna be 12 foot long. It's gonna be four foot wide. Just a door on one end with a roof over the top on the backside. Nothing real complex, but it should work good for what we're doing. We should be able to fit four guys in it. Nice, comfortable. So we'll probably run a time lapse for most of this just so you can kind of see what's going on. And we'll update you here and there and kind of explain a little bit what we're doing. But just wanted to take you along for the ride. Hopefully it helps some of you guys if you're thinking about building a blind. If not, just enjoy. Big city for the simple country life. Found myself a woman that it took for me to be my way. I was working on the ground come a sun up to sun time. Hey, I'm trying to make a reputation for a man inside this town. Hard as I try, maybe I just can't. I ain't no up and kind of leave. Kissed me one time and she took my heart Baby, you can love me, you can leave me I'm a honky-tonk star Yeah, I'm a honky-tonk star Well, working three jobs, living out of a car Mama never told me life would get this hard Running around the world playing my guitar Baby, you can love me, you can leave me I'm a honky-tonk star Yeah, I'm a honky-tonk star Like a cigarette or a line of cocaine on a private jet. I gave them good love and like they won't forget. Baby, good Lord knows what time it is. Hard as I try, maybe I just can't. I ain't no up and kind of leaving me. She kissed me one time and she took my heart. Baby, you can love me, you can leave me. I'm a honky tonk star. Well, working three jobs, living out of the car. Mama never told me life would get this hard. Running around the world playing my guitar Baby, you can love me, you can leave me I'm a honky-tonk star Yeah, I'm a honky-tonk star I'm a honky-tonk star Lord, I'm a honky-tonk star All right, guys. Well, we ran you through the time lapse for most of this, but I'll go over our ideas and thoughts on some of this. Hopefully it makes sense to you, but really what we wanted to do is we didn't want this roof too far over the top of us to where it kind of restricted us. And, you know, I'm not that tall. I'm like 6'2". Jake's like six foot. We just wanted enough room to where we weren't bumping our heads. So that was kind of one thing that we uh, debated on when we were doing this. So as you can see, um, we kind of, the angle that we kept it on here, is uh, obviously lower in the back and uh, a little higher in the front there, but it works. It should be it should be just fine for what we're doing. The front of it here is uh, we made this four foot, and I think that'll work okay. That's really not that bad. It gives you once you get out from underneath the roof there a little bit. It's not too bad, you know, as far as getting up over the top of it to shoot. Um, we put a bench in there, that bench goes all the way across, um, from side to side, and, uh, I don't know, you know, it's not that complex, it's just, 
trying to make sure we get it the way we want it. And we actually have another spot up here that we might put another blind. So this will kind of be a test more or less to see how we like it. Not really sure what we're going to do with this door on the side. We may actually make a door out of wood or we may kind of build something out of bungees and just brush it in. But overall, I mean, it should, it should work either way, you know? So we're going to keep going. We really don't have that much left. We're putting hemlock all around the front. It's all pine and uh we just got to finish doing that we got the tin we're putting tin on the roof um and that's really it that'll be it for at least building it we're gonna go a little excessive i guess if you want to call it that and we are putting an led light bar across the top here just for setting out decoys and stuff we got a switch panel place to charge your phones um we'll probably just have a deep cycle battery in it so overall pretty simple you know, if you want to do something like this, especially if you wanted to get your kids involved or something, it's really, I mean, it's not that bad. If you got any kind of building skills at all, you can get it done. So we'll keep going and update you here as we go. All right, guys, we uh, pretty much wrapped up for today. We got it, eh, I'd say about 90%. Um, still got a couple things we're gonna touch up. Gonna grab a couple more pieces of wood here for some trim and whatnot. Not that it's really necessary, but just trying to make it a little bit better, but it looks good, man. All the tins up on the roof. Uh, I'll walk you around and show you, but overall, I mean, it was, uh, not bad and and honestly we did this pretty budget friendly we just other than the pressure treated we had some tin laying around which um you know if you don't have it even if you had to buy it it's not a whole lot so i think overall we have like right around 500 bucks in this and it's pretty nice i mean it's uh plenty big for what we wanted that was uh one of our things that we wanted to make sure of is you know just that we had enough room in it, uh, especially if we wanted to have a, a couple other guys come hump, but this will fit six guys pretty comfortable. I mean, it's 12 foot. You wouldn't have any issues having, having six guys in here. We'll probably have three or four most of the time, and it's gonna be really roomy for that. Um, but we got a switch panel, uh, LED, just a light to throw in the front of this. Um, that's really it, just a little control panel with some switches, charging ports. 
and we're gonna throw that on uh, that'll probably be in a separate video but that's about it I'll take you around show you kind of what it looks like everything on the outside is all hemlock 8 inch hemlock rough cut and then uh, like I said the whole frames out of pressure treated we just didn't want to have to deal with it rotten on us so here it is um, other than that that'll wrap this up it was a quick fun build we really have been talking about this for the past year so I'm glad we got to do it um, that's it stay tuned for the next one mm -hmm.